Hey guys, Footy Manager TV here. Welcome to episode number 47 of my lower league management playthrough in Football Manager 2014 with Bath City. And as you know, we have been on a pretty bad run, losing some games after starting fantastically uh, 6-3 and then 5-0 away against Farnborough, who actually, that's the same kind of fixture really, just in the FA Cup. So I would be expecting a similar result, but the game has... Uh, do you see last match? I was so frustrating. We got a red card, injury to Callahan, but he's still fit to play, luckily. Uh, but Putman is going to be missing, which, yeah, it can't, it's not going to be the same game because we don't have that killer striker who scored four goals because he got a yellow card. Apparently, the game thought he dived. Surely, he wouldn't have dived when he was already on a yellow card. And if he, And if he did, he must be dumb. Come on. That's just so frustrating. Think I'm just going to forget about it and try and move on. But we should be beating them. Uh, we played fantastically. But we'll see how it goes, I guess. We'll see what happens. But here, we're going to bring on Watton for Ngoy. He hasn't played that great, I guess. We need to do much, much better. Look, can't we just go back to playing like we did in the first couple of games? But we don't have our star striker, Tolly. But he was a star for us once. He feels so long ago when he just joined the club and scored that 12 goals in 11 games and was insane. I'm pretty score, uh, sure he, he scored like four goals in one game in like a, a playoff match. <laughs> Come on. Get back to that, son. Please. I'm begging you. We need the money. If it's not next season, yeah, well, if it's not this season, again, it just hopes goes into next season again to go on cup runs. It has to be now, please, I'm praying. I am praying. Please, Tolly, you did it once. Do it again for us. Show your skill. Please. <laughs> it's not a good sign, is it, if I'm begging this early in the season, but it's going to come. It's... Oh, that was lucky. But yeah, we are playing attacking. Come on. Need to be smart. Need to be. It's not. Hap I can't do anything. I can't. Oh, what? I that could have been offside. Oh no, I probably wasn't. But look at that. What are you doing? I'm just talking about our team. Oh, they've got a player off. Take the opportunity. You better take the opportunity and score. There's a highlight. There has to be a goal for us, please. Oh, they give it away. Now. Stern. Thank God. Oh, okay. Well done. It's just a continuation. It's a continuation from the previous rubbish. In the previous games. It's a new episode, but the same rubbish. Because I'm recording it on the same day. Ball. O'Callaghan. Goal. That's better. Yeah, don't disallow it, mate. There you go. That's better. Of course, there'll be someone complaining there, Moody, to the referee. Eventually, we'll get the breakthrough. O'Callaghan, great run. He's been a great signing as well. How good has he been? Tolly, finish it. Oh, what is he trying to do? Trying to lob the keeper. Tolly, well done. Nice header for O'Callaghan. Ball, Adelsbury, O'Callaghan. Tolly! Oh, this is good. This is good. Oh, again, no, nah, come on. You can't say this is complaining about the game. It's been too often. If you compare it, how many times my opposition gets disallowed goals. It's, it's not fair. Surely this can't be correct. Is it just me? I don't know. How can I have this many disallow goals? This time. Yes. Is this going to count? <laughs> yes, finally. We're in the lead. Uh, it deserves to be a bit more. We've had a couple disallow goals. Uh, O'Callaghan played in Tolly, and Tolly showing he can be clinical as well. Great finish. But his first of the season. Hopefully he can push on now. 
But O'Callaghan's been killer. He scored and got her assist. Let's say passionately, I'm pleased. We've had a good game, really. We've played really, really well. Probably deserve a better buffer, like at least two goals we should be winning by. But I'll take this. Oh, their goalkeeper has a knock? Oh, well, this could be dangerous. Come on. Ball, or oh, good ball for Stern. Nah, just wasted it. But hopefully keep makes error. Just give it to us or something. Oh, look at that error. 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 Stern, finish it. Nah. Have to just blast that at him or something. I don't know. He has a knock. Can you hard tackle the keeper? <laughs> I'm not sure that'll be good. Oh, he tested him here, but Hope makes the save. Okay, we'll make a sub here before we concede, yeah. Oh, I have to keep O'Callaghan on, but I don't want him to get injured. What do I do? I'll bring on Calvin Bossman for some pace down the right wing. Ryan Watts actually, yeah, for ball, a bit of pace. And then, mm, I don't know if I should do it. Now, nah, Anthony Jack, like he's been good. Oh, I don't want Callahan to get injured or O'Callaghan, as his name is. <laughs> and hopefully don't get an injury. Please. Adelsbury. Let's just go to counter now. We might score. Oh, we do. What a sub. It's, yeah, it counts. Wow. <laughs> well done, Jack. That's a decent sub, is it? He comes on, scores right away. He's definitely, he's calling out to me right now. He wants to be a starting player. Uh, but at least I know when O'Callaghan needs a rest, Jack can step up and he can score. Look at that. He went bang. Near post. Goalkeeper had no chance to save that. Perfect timing. Oh, Mackenzie, good header away. At least we're going to win this. Come on. Unless some rubbish happens completely. Oh, good tackle, Gallinar. He's been so good for me. Oh, no. Not a crossfield ball from there. It's going to lead to a goal. I can tell. Now put the cross in and smack. How did I know? I can tell the way Football Manager is. I've played it so much. I know when you concede. You play, you give that error, and it always leads to a goal. Or at least 99% of the time. Errors always lead to goals. Even if there's heaps to play, but when they get that cross in, no one marking. Uh, I knew it. I knew it. I just know how Football Manager works. A cup game, and after going defensive as well. It's just a mixture. And I wouldn't be surprised if we can see it again, but it's good tackling. Bossman win it. See, that's his strength. And now, yeah, you got a red card. Ah, uh, bye, mates. You're off. Bye. <laughs> We've got it now, surely. Have fun. Now, I'm going to move to attacking here. Hopefully, it doesn't bite me, but we could look for another goal to seal it. And it's better to dominate possession than let them have it on counter, because counter's sitting back. And yeah, that showed we dominated possession for the rest of the game, and it's over. It's over. Just blow the ritual whiff, and it is. Come on, O'Callaghan. Well done. Once again, scored and assisted. And passionate. I've got to give him credit to keep that morale high. Come on. We advance and give us that money. Yeah, we had double shots on target. We deserved to win that, without a doubt. Had more clear-cut chances. Deserved it. Well done. And it's good for Tolly to score as well, to get his match fitness up, because he hasn't been playing much as well. We're given 4.5k. Still, we need more than that. It's good to come back as well. Um, but we should have bet them. Definitely. We deserve that. Next, we've got Borham Wood in the league. We're playing that much. How long is that match? Oh, it's seven days. So we're going to have a bit of a break until then, which is much needed to get the Mitch, yeah, um, to get the fitness levels up. So that's great. Okay, so here's the FA Cup third qualifying round draw. Let's see who we draw. Hopefully someone like a lower team in my league once again. Uh, you can see FC United, the big team there. Oh, they've actually made it now. They always, they always get up there. The Red Rebels. But anyway, where are we? Who are we playing against all Wheelstone? Are they good? Or oh, they've got some players. I'm pretty sure they were in our league. Aaron Howe, was he there? 
Uh, it's it's going to be hard. I'm not going to check through all their players. But anyway, uh, they've got some injuries. And yeah, we should be beating them, I reckon. Oh, Lorik, Lorik Perez. Like, this guy, he was he was in the school premier two seasons ago. I'm going to get a scout report on him. He'll definitely want to. If I offer zero, would they accept? I don't know. He's a, oh, I can't sign him anyway because of wages. Oh, that's frustrating at this level. Like, when you see a guy you want to sign... Well, his finishing isn't that great, but he's a winger. Like, he's got that bit of pace. Well, he's he looks better than I think he is, probably. I, I just see him because he played school Premier for Dartford. Then they dropped down there, but... Where's Dartford now? See, they're still there. But I don't know. When I saw him first, I knew he was good. Like, when they were playing in our league. You can see there, but he has no... No intention. Okay. Okay, so the league match against Boreham Wood, home match as well as here, will be looking for a win. We've pushed down to 15th, which is absolutely shocking uh, considering our start to the season. But a lot of teams on top of us have already played their game, so we could look to, well, the most we can push up is maybe to around a 10th position where Bromley is, but we need to just show signs, show signs of improving. That's all I want to see. That's all I want to see. And also, I made some changes. I bring uh, the boss back in, into the right wing, Hopefully, he can make an impact. I need him. Like, he's a player who can uh, do something special. I'm hoping, anyway, because he's got the pace. He's got a bit of strength as well for a winger. Aggression, flair. Uh, he's a guy I would hope can do something special for us. And you've got O'Callaghan, who's, you know about him, and Putman coming back in after the suspension from diving, apparently, which I still think is funny. Made some changes here. Actually bringing Wooten into defensive midfield, dropping out Dutton. We'll see what kind of impact this will make in the team. Like, this... Starting 11 is really strong. If you compare it to previous years when I've had young players, you've got, look, Putman, he's an old player. Not old, he's like 25. Williams, he's still a younger player, but now he's 20. And then you've got O'Callaghan, like 35 or 36 now. Uh, Bossman, how old is he? 24. Uh, Adelsbury, around that age as well, 23, and improving in his attributes as well. Long shots, hopefully can get some on. Uh, Watton. 38 and improving as well in a lot of areas, which is, well, I'm surprised to see that, but I'll take that any day of the week. And Ball, uh, he's 23. McKenzie, 21. Going down, unfortunately, some attributes. Actually, should I take him out? I'm going to bring Dutton in centre-back. So see how he goes at centre-back. No, actually, put him in his preferred role. And Wooten also in his preferred role. That seems better. Uh, but anyway, then there's Ngoy who's 25, and then if I show you Dutton again, he's 30, and then Gallinar, 30, so we've got a lot of experience, actually, this team's really experienced, so, uh, yeah, you can't say my team is not experienced anymore, and I made bad signings, it's not a young team anymore, it's really changed, come on, we have to win, get back on the winner's list, but if we don't, even if we draw, we're going to be in trouble, even though my... Or just, we'll see what happens here. Okay, nothing. When... Uh, I'm actually still on my expectations, though. My expectations is still just to get a respectable league position. Of course, people want you to get promoted, but my expectations is not to get promoted. Our team is not expected for that. Our team is not good enough for that. Oh, lucky there. So, you can't expect me to get promoted. Like, I chose a team that's didn't have amazing finances, so I'm always, always going to have trouble in having a team that's going to compete with the top teams. Uh, but I was able to do that. Like, at uh, different times, you've seen me dominate in all the seasons I've played so far, but I haven't done it consistently. And I guess this season is a perfect explanation once again. It's been inconsistent, but I'm doing what I can do, my best for the expectations we have. Oh, come on. Don't... Oh, we're defending strong here. We are defending strong. Okay, that was pretty poor corner, wasn't it? Uh, by them. And actually, we, we, we've been working on attacking set pieces. So if we get a set piece, we could score. Uh, but we, I don't want to be giving away... Look, look error. Or almost, almost once again, an error has led to a goal. But it was good. Well, say... Churchill's been pretty good, actually, despite conceding some goals this season. Uh, he's actually got decent ratings. I'm surprised with the amount of goals we've conceded. He's got decent ratings. He must be doing his job. So someone's injured here, the Ashton guy. 
Uh, but hopefully we can do something in the second half. Not too bad. As long as we're not losing. <laughs> as long as we're not losing. Let's go Sir Divan. I'm far from pleased. Just to fire up my players. Even though I secretly am pleased. But we need to get a win. We need to get a win here. Oh no. Defend it. No. No. I knew, I knew we were going to concede something like that. It's the way it's been going right now. So right now I'm probably doing worse than I was with younger players. I'm going to be pushing down. Wow. We need to get a goal right back here. We're on attacking as well. We don't really look like scoring. Come on, just forge another attack. Williams, Adelsbury, giving away once again. Just give it to O'Callaghan. Or O'Callaghan, whatever his name is. Dutton, O'Callaghan, create it. Bossman. He's not playing like a boss. I thought he would because of his name. Well, not just because of his name. That would be stupid, but... Come on, O'Callaghan. Bossman this time. Yeah, oh! Partman, how did he not get it on target from there? With his finishing. Wow. At least we're creating chances. Partman this time. Oh! Unlucky. Oh, we have another chance. Come on, we deserve a goal from all this dominance. Again, oh, I am shocked. I am shocked. Okay, O'Callaghan will bring him off for Jack. We did that last time and he scored, remember? Uh, Stern to come on from Bossman. Mm, I'm not sure who else. Actually, Ben Garner for Adelsbury. He's a good young talent for us. He came through our intake. And we haven't had the same dominance from our intake of last season and the previous season. Like, you know, our goalkeeper was from the first season and Tolly. Yeah, we didn't really get that impact. Regens from last year that came through. That are, yeah, they're not really playing. That's what I mean. But come on, score, please. No. Oh, overload. Please. Please. I wanted to win this. Come on, please. Putman. Oh, he's saving us. We're on overload. Go for the win. Yeah, go for the win. I'll support that. Dutton, that's a good ball. So he, he is actually good. Dutton is good. Uh, you can see. I could have easily let him go, but I always thought he was well rated. But anyway, it's good to get that goal back in a game where... Yeah, we didn't play our best. It's good to get something out of it. I'm happy about that. I'm still far from pleased, though. I'll say that because that's what gets good reactions. But 57 percent possession. Eight on target. Five clear-cut chances. Wow. Well, judging off that, we played well. I'm not sure what you think. Uh, very disappointing. But, see, we're 15th. If I go to con the confidence, where am I? Confidence. My job status is basically full. And squad harmony as well. We, ha I'm, They're delighted with the harmonious atmosphere. I'm not sure how you create that, I guess, just by winning. But, school South, look here. The minimum expectation is that the team achieve a respectable league position. And right now, they said they're pleased. They're currently on course to achieve respectable league position. So what is respectable? Is it just lower mid-table? So if I just avoid relegation, I'll keep my job. Who knows? But yeah, Lewis Putman, he's improving it in some attributes. I need that. I need him to get as good as he can in other ways, other parts of his game, apart from his finishing, which he is doing. His leadership, anticipation, which is important for a striker as well, crossing, and agility. Come on. Because if you look at that, his only report is two and a half star. That's just like an average player. That's like a backup player. But, of course, he has the high finishing. So, he's good. Look at this current season. Uh, profit, 107K. At least we're gaining. We've got to keep that going. I'm not sure where that's coming from. I know we sold Alan Ryder. A, bit, a big part's going to come from that. Uh, but we'll play one more game, Bassingstoke. Then, the next episode, we can start for the FA Cup game once again against Wealdstone. 
So here's the game against Bassing Stoke. They're currently 10th, and we're 15th. Again, we've had teams that's played another game. So if we win, yeah, we can push up. Maybe push up to a... Or we could only push up to 14 points where Dartford is, but still... It's more about just getting confidence, uh, getting winning confidence back. We beat Farnborough in the FA Cup, but league performances had, uh, I guess, ever since the first two games have been a bit shaky. We still picked up a win against Staines, but since then, yeah, it hasn't been positive. So we go to tactics uh, to select the team. What was the last game? Yeah, 1-1. One, one. I didn't think... Look, we actually played well, didn't we? We played a good game, but... Yeah, Curtis McKenzie will come on for Wooten here. Watton and... And Goy is probably going to have to get dropped as well. I'm going to... I'm going to play some youth, actually. Stuart Jones. He's got decent potential. And he's improving in his physical attributes. Has potential to be a good Skrill Premier Central Defender in the future. So, yeah, above this level at the very, very least. So... If he can keep improving physically, that's really good. He's already strong, and now he's improving his quickness, which is fantastic. What's he working in training? Is he improving that or... Yeah, working on his quickness. So it is actually working, and he's got good determination, teamwork as well. Some important attributes, so we need him to have a good game, especially when other players' condition is low. It's an opportunity for him to play. Bossman going to come out. Stern. Stern's probably the better player, if I'm honest, because we've already had experience with him. He scored before for me. As you know, yeah. So, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Putman needs to get back on form. If I go to... He still scored, but not as consistent. Like, first two games, he scored seven goals together. Like, it needs to be that kind of form. He's still been consistent goal scorer. I'm happy with what he's done as an overall kind of result so far. 12 goals in nine games. So, you got to be happy with that. He's leading the goal scoring in the league. I even knew that before I checked it because you, you wouldn't imagine someone to have more than that, but... We need, where do you think, because of course we have O'Callaghan playing really, really well, and then Putman, where do you think we need to improve? Because usually if you have that kind of impact, you should be a lot higher, so maybe it's our defense, but I thought I improved my defense well, get some experience, but now we're changing it up a little bit. Yeah, you got Jones playing, let's see what he does, a younger player. Anyone else that come in right back? Uh, Gallinar, got to keep, well, he hasn't had amazing ratings, that's... That's the thing. But he's always been a consistent player uh, for me throughout. But we'll see. I'm happy with this lineup at least. We'll see how we go. Going to look for the win. Sam Smith, hard tackle this guy. Jamie Smith. They've got a lot of Smiths. Sorry about this thing that popped off. But anyway, uh, do some hard tackling of some players. Who's Ramon Rose? He sounds like a good player. But he doesn't look like a good player. Where did he come from? QPR? Yeah, I, I remember his name. I don't know why. That's why I thought he came from a big team. But QPR at least. He's got pace. So you have to be wary of him. I might close him down and show him to the weaker foot. But how about that Sam Smith guy? Is he good? Nothing special. He just got strength. So yeah, not sure what to do with him. But anyway, we'll just leave. We've got to focus on our game. Come on, O'Callaghan. He's got nine assists in nine games, so he's averaging assist every game. That's pretty good. Come on, lad. Show everyone what you can do here today. A win away from home should boost morale. It will be good before a FA Cup game next in next episode. Putman. Come on. No, they're through. Don't be. Yeah, well done. See, that was Rose. Uh, but he basically wasted it, and what, so for some reason we just kicked it out there. Someone's injured, okay. See, at least my team, we play fair. We play fair, so... Oh, now we have an extra player on. Now take the impact. Go, but they've got a lot of players back, so... May not score. But Guillaume's on, surely. Assist it or finish it yourself. Nah, you got to do better than that. Now, yeah, they got all players back on now. We couldn't take the chance like we did once before. But I don't know. I have a positive feeling about this game. Just the way it's going. I feel as though we can score. It's just all up to our defense. <laughs> what we're going to do in these crossing situations. Uh, but I don't know about you, but I concede a lot of goals actually from crosses. Like it's FIFA or something. Come on. But that's good defending there. 
And Churchill should develop into a great player because he's getting so much experience. But again, we give it away. Churchill, don't make a mistake. Oh, that was cool. You can see he's getting more experience and playing well, actually. Improving from last season. Just better decisions than that. O'Callaghan, play it through. This time, for Stern. Oh, that deserved a goal. That deserved a goal. I don't care what you say. Like, that was a great ball. Come on, finish it. Oh, my God. This had to be a goal. Whoa, just... I can't believe we're not in front. We couldn't take that opportunity. Assertive. Let's go with that option. Oh, motivating. Whew, I was surprised about that. I wasn't sure what to do there, but it was a good reaction nonetheless. Come on, push on. That last chance we created was great. We need more of that. Come on, Putman. You need to get on the end of some chances. No, we need to make subs. It's not happening here. Oh, O'Callaghan, yep. Again, we're going to make that sub. Jack coming on. Williams hasn't been good enough. We'll bring on Ryan Watts for some pace, actually. And Bossman on the opposite side for Stern. There we go. We're bring some pace on wide, and hopefully that'll make impact. Yeah, even Watts, his natural position, yeah, he's definitely not an inside forward, but it's all about the setup of the team. That's why it's so good. Well... If it was so good, we'll be doing better. Maybe I do need to change him. But O'Callaghan scores anyway. Who cares what I'm talking about, yeah? See, they thought it was offside. Maybe this time it's going our way instead of getting a disallowed goal. Let's check if that was offside. It, it wouldn't have been offside. Nah, don't give me that. That's a goal near post. Bang. Now, we'll go counter. Perfect timing. O'Callaghan, because I've got to keep him fit. Like I've been saying, I have to manage him really, really well so he doesn't get long-term injuries. Because he's a key player. He's showing that right now. He's showing he's more important than Putman. Oh, we're going to take the points. Oh, yes. Come on. Oh, it's going to go in. <laughs> it nearly went in. Uh, but anyway, George O'Callaghan once again. If anyone remembers him, uh, leave in your comments as well. Because he used to play for uh, in, a, in the Irish League, didn't he? And in for championship level, League 1 quite some time ago. And this, yeah, this league, is that yeah, the highest? Yeah, the highest level? The Irish League. But anyway, yeah, he's doing really well for me. He's played at League One level. So, of course, he's kind of holding on to some of that technical attributes, which is really, really good. And, yeah, he's showing that he is. And I was almost not going to sign him. Like, I thought too old, too slow, but he's showing he's been amazing. Wow. Fantastic stuff. Really, really good. So, anyway, it's good to get the win there. We push up to 13th. Still getting, being in our expectation. But I still want to get promoted. Because people ask me, you haven't got promoted yet. And yeah, I just get frustrated when people say that. Like, it's not like I'm one of the better teams in the league. And it's, yeah, it's a long road. But we've got to make sure our team is a good, is in good position. That we don't go into the red by too much. And uh, we've still got quality players. So we're going to be in a good position. Definitely. We're going to hopefully continue to go back on some form. But we'll see. We'll see. Leave your thoughts anyway. We've got an FA Cup match against Wildston. We should beat them. I'm hoping anyway. Leave your thoughts on everything that's happened. And I'll see you guys next time.